ሰላም ጠና ይስጥልን እንዴት ናችሁ ያሬክሲቲቭ መስፍን ተከታታዮች እነሆን እንግዲህ ዛሬ ለየት ባለ መንገድ እንግዲህ ዞሮ ዞሮ ያጥንትን ይያል ያጥነጠን ያልነውን አብዛኛው ከ እንትኑ ኢንፌክሽየስ ዲሲሶች ላይ ነው ስለዚህ ኢንፌክሽየስ ዲሲስ መካከለ እንግዲህ የቴቶችኞቹ ሳይት ላይ ነው ኢንፌክሽን አታክ ሊያረግ የሚችል የሚለውን እንግዲህ በባለፈው በተከታታይ ያየን ነበር ዛሬ ደግሞ ሪስፓራቶር ትራክት ኢንፌክሽን አፐር ላይ ውስጥ ካሉት ውስጥ የመጀመሪያ ኦቲቲስ ሚዲያ የሚለውን እና ያለ ማለት ነው ስለዚህ እንግዲህ ዛሬ ኦቲቲስ ሚዲያ ነው እና ያው ማለት ነው ስለዚህ ይሄም እንግዲህ ካፐር ሪስፓራቶሪ ትራክት መካከለ ውስጥ የሚካተል ነው so majamari otitis media malam malatu no selezi otitis media is inflammation of a middle ear no milaw selezi ye inflammation of middle ear lay le kasat yemichil ye inflammation zirya no malatu no selezi it is mitlo arasu indicate mitarago inflammation mohono anno selezi there are three subtype of otitis media ilal selezi sostene subtype och allu ye majamari acute otitis media bele min taraw alle beulatenya dereja demo ኦቲቲስ ሚዲያ ዊዝ ኢፊዥን ብለምን ጠራዋለ በሶስተኛ ደረጃ ደግሞ ክሮኒክ ኦቲቲስ ሚዲያ ብለምን ጠራቻለ ሶ ዘ 3 አር ዲፈረንት ሼት ባይ ላ ስለዚህ አንዱ ካንዱ ሚለያይበት ለምሳሌ ኦቲቲስ ሚዲያ ዊዝ ኢፊዥን ያል ነው አኪዩት ኦቲቲስ ሚዲያ እና ክሮኒክ ኦቲቲስ ሚዲያ ብለምን ጠራው አኪዩት ሳይን ኦፍ ኢንፌክሽን አንዱ አይንዲኬት የሚያረጋው ለይነታችን የሚገልጽ ነው ማለት ነው በሁለተኛ ላይ ደረጃ ደግሞ ኤቪደንስ ኦፍ ሚድል ኢር ኢንፍላሜሽን ነው ስለዚህ ኤቪደንሶቹንም ወሳኝነት አላቸው ምክንያቱም ኦቲቲስ ሚዲያ ማለት ራሱ ኢንፍላሜሽን ኦፍ ሚድል ኤር ብለን ስለጠራ ነው ማለት ነው በሶስተኛ ደረጃ ደግሞ ፕሬዘንስ ኦፍ ፍሉድ ኢን ዘ ሚድል ኤር ላይ ያለው የፍሉድ መጠኑ ተልቁን ዲፈረንሺየት እንድናረጋቸው ከመረዱን መካከል አንዶቹ ናቸው ማለት ነው ሶ ዘር አር ሞር 709 ሚሊዮን ኬዝ ኦፍ ኦቲቲስ ሚዲያ otitis media worldwide each yearna half of these cases occur in children under 5 years old no ngidi yezina hal gimashu happen liyarag emichino almost half of the 709 million people uh, less than 5 uh, years uh, child nacho ma otitis media is a most common infant in the children line no ngidi በብዛት ሊከሰት የሚችል ኢንፋንቶች ላይና children ላይ ነው the risk factor for amoxicillin resistance bacteria as acute uh, otitis media includes attendance at a child care center recent receipt of antibiotic treatment ስለዚህ ምን ምን ያስፈልጋል የአሞክሳሲሊ ሬዚስታንሱን አይዳንቲፋይ ማድረግ አለብን in acute otitis media ላይ ይሄ ማለት እንግዲህ attendance of child care center እንደገና recent receipt of antibiotic treatment past in 30 days na age younger than 2 years emilawun enezi betam ya antibiotic history yacho medem madergen identify maregal lebem mekniyatum bacterialu la amoxicillin zirriyawoch resistance ne wes adellem emilawun mawqal lebem zon pathophysiology going to going to pathology approximately 50 to 44 to 75% of acutitis media cases are caused by viral pathogens ila so especially viral viral nacho ngidi almost cover le arag michila 40 to 75% of otitis media bele min tera 35 up to 40% demo cover le arag len yemichilut nema nacho this one is bacterial nacho for this one is bacteria and for 40 to 75% cost most of them ba virus no malet no miyawla especially from the bacteria streptococcus pneumonia is the most common bacterial cause of acute otitis media ilena so nan nan type of strain of hemophilus influenza and moroxella cataraglis are each responsible 32 to 35% yal cover emarega leqam allo this one is for especially influenza now also 15 to 18 demo for moroxella uh, respectively menya ragallu malat responsible nacho acute bacteria otitis media usually follow a viral upper respiratory tract nacho infection that causes eustachian um, tube dysfunction and mucosal swelling in the middle ear no selezi eustachial tube dysfunction yemefterna mucosal swelling yemefter aqmallo at middle ear lay mala this one especially happen by in the presence of bacterial no milo ngidi ስለዚህ ባክቴሪያዎች ይችላል ነው የሚያሳየ አፕ ቱ 40% ኦፍ ስታፍሎኮከስ 
pneumonia is isolated in the anal state at penicillin non-sensitive nature and also half of these have high level penicillin resistance no. so approximately 30 to 40 percent of h influenza and greater than 90 percent of meroxella cataralis isolate from the upper respiratory tract produce beta lactamizochin produce bamarag yitawakalu no selezi bekalalu ba amoxacillin resistance menoru ala menoru telek contribution ichawatalu mekniatum mene maraga akim selalacho beta lactamiz mi balaun enzyme produce maraga akim ala this is beta lactamase responsible for uh, most uh, antibiotic resistance uh, michawat no malatno uh, zen clinical presentation for uh, titus media Irritability and tagging on the ear are often in first clue that child has acute otitis media. Elena. So, a diagnosis for acute otitis media requires the following three criteria. As well, the first one is acute sign of infection, evidence of middle ear inflammation, and the presence of fluid in middle ear. Identify. The latter, latter two criteria must be determined by auto oscopic examination no ilena identify men narago the sign of infection must be acute and maybe non specific including fever baustu alla almost 75% of patient na milena so younger children may be irritable and talk on the involved no ear and have difficulty to sleeping happen yarag ichilal no sign the symptom of middle ear inflammation includes erysema hello tam panic Tiamphanic membrane and autalgia uh, yeme fetar sign na sip tamochu na ziba bizat yitayalu especially in at otitis media malatno middle ear infusion is indicated by the uh, following la fullness or bulging of the tiamphanic membrane la most important sign in limited or absent mo mobility of the tiamphanic membrane la also otaria blement aracho boast acho yeme kasat this one is related with uh, middle arrow effusion. Then when going to uh, treatment, first goal of treatment, the goal are pain management. No? So let's see, with uh, supporting of anti-pain, the first issue to reduce the around the middle air to reduce the pain. Now, so a prudent antibiotic use now and uh, secondary disease prevention. Acute otitis media should first to be differentiated from otitis media with effusion or chronic otitis media. Milan uh, identify maraginorbinal. The primary prevention of acute, uh, acute otitis media with vaccine should be considered now. So let's see as a prevention minute. Come as a prophylaxis and get a Zoro Zoro prevention in the Ngidi ask at the more otitis media in its anatline daika setting giddy vaccine ochum be metacum, men maraginchala, macalacal in chala, macnatu, almost casabatma to a miss million macacal us and giddy, Abzan yuchu, the marshal chuvalat in chala and his anat naturally gallas omichulus lazi, its anademobic alalu, ye days retus higher than adult rate. No, so the seventh valent pneumococcal conjugate vaccine produced on occurrence of acute. Otitis media by five to six to seven percent during infancy recommended the regal. So the vaccine did not benefit older children with history of acute otitis media. Lala bach older children lala mo vaccine is not effective. No, manas no. Pain of otitis media should be addressed with oral analgesic. No, oral analgesic. Tatak ban nata falam. For example, acetaminophen or non-steroid anti-inflammatory agents such as ibuprofen should be. Over to relieve pain acute otitis media now. So let's think uh, most of the responses for, for anti-pain purpose, acetaminophen and then steroidal anti-inflammatory, especially uh, epoprofen milan. So the congestant or uh, antihistamine should be should not be recommended for acute or acute otitis media, antihistamine and because they provide minimal effect effect not so let's see the congestant or antihistamine should not be recommended during acute otitis media a brief observation period should be considered to determine whether the patient requires immediate antibiotic therapy because of disease severity patient character city was antimicrobial therapy is used to treat otitis media treat lamarag minute takamongri bamindinaw sumalatno ba antibacterial no 
However, a high percentage of children will be cured with symptomatic treatment alone. No, Gri, so that's the Barasachom Gri, Abzanuchum Maragak Malacho, Medanak Malachon. Delayed antibiotic treatment 48 up to 72 hours may be considered in children 6 months to 2 years of age. If symptoms are not severe and the diagnosis is uncertain, and in children 2 years of age or older with uncertain diagnosis, delayed treatment decreases antibiotic adverse effect and minimize bacterial resistance let's see the effect of delayed antibiotic treatment and most of it decreases antibiotic adverse effect and minimize bacterial resistance and diameter high dose of amoxacin a to up to 90 mg per kg per day is the drug of choice for acute otitis media now so let's see amoxacin in one degree samania that on a milligram per kg minute i'm gonna acute otitis media but a lot drug of choice actually a beta lactam is producing pathogen are suspected or now amoxacin should be given with clavonet 80 mg per kg per day of amoxacin with 6.5 4 mg tay equivalent to divided dose lazi bekan hulete and set actualan if suspect of beta lactamase enzyme alle belan kagemetin malatnu so if treatment failure occur with amoxicillin an agent should be chosen with activity against beta lactamase producing h influenza and uh mata cataralis belemin tarawalla as well as uh drug resistance staphylococcus or pneumonia such as high dose amoxicillin clavonate recommended or sephroxim so let's see the amoxicillin resistance we are going to augment it sephroxim sephdenerin sephpodoxim sephrozin or intramuscular sephtraxin in the time in children at least six years old who have mild to moderate acute otitis media, a five to seven day course of antibiotic may be used. No, so let's see. Most of the children in Gedi recommend me the regular three to five day. No, but when the otitis media account against the case is otitis media, the treatment should be five to seven days, the duration of treatment. So let's see. Does it know the other So some experts have speculated that patient can be treated for little of three to five days now. Yes, but short uh, course treatments no recommend the child younger to two years. But recommend that surgical insertion of uh, stomy tube is effective method of prevention of recurrent otitis media. Patient with acute otitis media should be reassessed after three days with most children being asymptomatic at seven days in so antibiotic for acutitis um acute otitis media gas and met and antibiotic or chalu brand name was a model of those or chala and a comment to china so let's see amoxacillin is 80 to 90 milligram per kg you know it is first line now non severe corona marathon um divided dose twice daily marathon but can let the amoxacillin clavonate the more augmenting belement around the more 90 milligram Per kg per day, amox plus amoxicillin uh, and the clavonic acid. Belement around also this one is the same too. Uh, amoxicillin first if the patient is at severe stage like all the malatno. Safe denerin, safe roxim, safe pum edemo resistance like no. Likasa to Mitchell azithromycin, clarithromycin, safe drugs and belement aracho de mongedi. Nan type one allergic or non severe corona, nazimadanitoch. Safe then is safe roximina, safe for the podoximina takam alan, safe drugs and one to three days later more, let it takam nan, type one allergy, hono, severe kaona malatno, also azithromycin, clarithromycin, dam kaono demo, type one allergy, non severe kono no malatno. Failure at 48 to 72 hours, lamental and grip, amoxacin clavonic, first line, nan, severe kona, netakam ala majamaragan. As a severe number of the initial diagnosis, but on the failure, it is like on again as a first line. Safe drugs and demo one to three is first line if severe corona no mea science. So let's see, severe case corona, safe drugs and is only initial stage. Severe line, I'm going to take a more, a zim line, a more severe mono no mea malatno. 
ምክንያቱም ትልቅ ኮንትሪቢዩሽን የመጫወት አቅም ስለሚኖረው ማለት ነው አልሶ ክሊንዳ ማይሲን አልሶ ሴፍትራክዘን ፎር ነን ሲቨር ኬዝ ነው ምንጠቀመው ክሊንዳ ማይሲን ነው ለሲቨር ኬዝ ምንጠቀመው ማለት ነው ስለዚህ ይሄ ነን ታይፕ 1 አላርጂ ሆኖ ይሄ ነን ታይፕ 1 ኢፍ ዘ ፔሸንት ኢዝ ሲቨር ኦታይተስ ሚዲያ ካለው ምንጠቀመው ክሊንዳ ማይሲን ድረግ ኦፍ ቾይዛችን ነው እዚ ላይ ደግሞ ኢኒሻል ቴራፒ ላይ ደግሞ ሲቨር ኬዝ ከሆነ our drug of choice is uh, augmenting no malat no selezi yenen miyasayen so antibiotic prophylaxis for recurrent infection bilal men taraw lay ngidi recurrent otitis media as divine at least three episode in 6 months of at least four out of episode 2 12 mano selezi beyes sud store ust solete ሶስት ጊዜ መምጣት አቀማለሁ እንደው ደግሞ በአመት ውስጥ እስከ ሶስት የሚከሰት ከሆነ ማለት ነው so recurrent infection are one of concern because patient younger than 3 years are high risk of hearing loss ነው ስለዚህ language and learning disability happen ያረግ ይችላል otitis media ማለት ነው so data from study general do not favor prophylaxis ነው ሚለን እንግዲህ አጠቃላይ ይሄንን ነው የሚያሳየው እንግዲህ እስካሁን ድረስ ስለተከታተላችሁኝ አመሰግናለሁ ለዩቲዩብ አዲስ ከሆነችሁ ሰብስክራይብ ላይክ ሼር ኮሜንት ማድረጋችሁን አትርሱ በዛሬው ድረስ እስካሁን ድረስ እንግዲህ አብራችሁ ስለነበራችሁ ቴንክ ዩ ጉድ ላክ